All right, here's today's removal. Um, this thing has been here for at least two or three years that I'm aware of. Um, I came in and did a partial removal on this um, this year, back in the early spring. And uh, we did not get to this section here. Um, I did uh, make the folks aware that there was probably something back here, but at the time they were not interested in um, pursuing things any further. So uh, we stopped uh, basically here. Um, today's, uh, I'm trying to think what, what, what's today's date? The 21st of October. Uh, anyways. Uh, pretty late in the year doing a removal here, but um, there's all that's honey, 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 right there to that spray foam that starts the brood nest, and then there's some residual honey down over here. Um, I don't think there's any combs next door here. It's just right here in this bay, but uh, I will show you exactly why I'm doing a removal uh, this late in the year. So this is why I decided to do the removal. Um, it, this, this room reeks. This is thousands and thousands of dead bees uh, that died all over these windows. Um, they just couldn't get out. There's actually some there now. Um, live ones, that is. But um, yeah, this is, um, I mean, it reeks in here. This room is terrible. It smells like... Smells like a dying uh, animal. Um, anyways, uh, so I, I'm doing the removal because of this. This is carnage. So, um, yeah. This is where um, the top half of the colony was last year, down in there. Um, but nevertheless, uh, you can see it's gross. That's it. Removal in Baltimore.